Yo, YouTube, what's up? Tech King Mike back with another video. And we finally got the big boy in the building. Ladies and gentlemen, we got the Galaxy S22 Ultra going right alongside the baby brother, the Galaxy S22 Plus. So let's go on ahead and get into this thing. Now, as you can see by the box, I went with the Phantom Black Edition. I did go with the big boy. So I have a one terabyte unlocked model here. And you may be asking yourself, why would I go with a one terabyte model? And that's because I have a one terabyte iPhone 13 Pro Max. And I do intend on putting my SIM card inside of this phone and using it as my main phone. And on that one terabyte iPhone 13 Pro Max, you wouldn't believe me if I told you, but I am using 672 gigs of storage. So one terabyte is a must for me. And I've always had a one terabyte micro SD card in my Galaxy devices as long as they've been able to take them. Now, looking around the box, of course, same thing with the S22 Plus. Nothing in here, as you can see by how thin the box is. We know we don't get a charge, so let's go on ahead and move on from that. Let's put that off to the side. Same thing as the S22. You're going to literally get your instructions, your cable, SIM ejector tool right here. Nothing new, nothing fancy that we haven't already seen before, so we'll just put that to the side. But now, let's get into this Galaxy S22 Ultra. Now, man, it's been a long time since I've had a Note device. Uh, I haven't actually fully used the Note device since the Note 10 Plus. So this is going to be a welcome, welcome change. Now, obviously, first things first in the hand, definitely feels a lot different from the S22 Plus. As you can see, the height and the overall build is just, you know, completely different with that flat top and everything. Now, I was expecting this to be a matte finish, and it may be a matte finish it may just be that the plastic that's on it right now is throwing it off now of course we got that triple camera set or quad camera set up on the back i apologize we got the quad camera set up on the back here nice matte textured finish let's go on ahead for dramatic effect get that off of there we'll put that over here on the side and there it is folks the samsung s22 ultra in that phantom black it doesn't get more better than that always been on black not saying anything against the burgundy or any of the other colors that are out there, but this is the one to get right here, in my opinion. The black is always going to be the best. It's going to look good with cases, and it's just going to be a more clean, professional device, especially if you're planning on using this, you know, in a professional setting. So let's go ahead and power it on just to give you guys an idea of what that screen is going to look like once it gets going here, because the welcome screen is going to be that all white, and we'll be able to compare it next to the S22 Plus here which is a 6.7 inch display alongside this one. And man, already just impressed so far. Very light, doesn't feel as heavy as I expected it to feel. And of course, we have the return of the S Pen. Let's go ahead and pop that out real quick here. So you got your S Pen here. Your S Pen is nice with a rubberized coating this time around. So the S Pen has a nice rubberized coating. So it feels really good, almost makes it a little bit uh almost makes the actual resistance of going in and out of the silo uh, really nice. So shout out to Samsung for bringing the S Pen back. I know a lot of people that, you know, didn't really care for the fact that we went to the Ultra instead of the Note. But I got to be honest, man, in my opinion, this is the new normal. I'm glad that they consolidated the Note and the Ultra line. No longer do you have to wait uh, six months after the Ultra drops to see if you're going to get a better phone or you have to get the second hand from the S22 or the S line, you know, in the past. So, man, S22 Ultra is in the building. I'm going to go ahead and get this thing set up. My main SIM card will be going inside of this device. So we will be getting it nice and set up. And of course, make sure you stay tuned to the channel because we got case videos on the way. Got some Pataka cases, got some Rinky cases. And of course, I'm going to attempt to do this on camera for you guys. We got the White Stone Dome glass screen protector installation as well. And also stay tuned because we will have a burgundy unboxing because for the first time since the Note 8, me and my wife have done his and hers. So make sure you stay tuned for the burgundy unboxing coming to the channel really soon. But with that being said, folks, it's your guy, Tech King Mike. I will catch you all in the next video. S22 Plus, S22 Ultra unboxing first impressions. Loving it, man. Catch you guys in the next video. I'm out.